The Hoosier Park Classic goes to, once again, uh, Stinkin' Rich. We have Rolando Pena here. That was a great ride, but it makes it look like you're just along for the ride. I mean, he makes it look so easy for you guys all to together. He's an amazing horse. Can you walk us through the, the break and how it went? He's a wonderful horse. He stood in the gates real good. He broke out there with him, and that's all I was wanting, to break out with him and let him see them. I only touched him once time, and uh, he looked at the other horses. He said, I got you. I can go for this. <laughs> Yeah, he usually is really, really powerful. Once he gets a good eye on the other horse, it's like, I got this, and he puts it out there, you know. He's got to win, got to beat them all. Matt, what a horse, I heard you say. This horse is amazing, the defending champ here. This is six in a row, so obviously you haven't done anything different. You, he's just a winner. He is. Uh, the horse loves being in front. Uh, he's as classy and as hard a competitor as you could ask for. And he just keeps getting better. I mean, he, he knows what he has to do every time. Uh, he was a little little more excited about today's race than he normally would be, but uh, didn't seem to bother him a bit when the gates opened. And then it didn't seem to bother him a bit after the race either. He wasn't even blown or anything, and he's five years old now. So do you have to do anything special after the races, or you just keep doing what you're doing? Just keep doing what we're doing. No, no reason to fix it. That's right. <laughs> if it ain't broke, don't fix it. And Carolyn, the year uh, <laughs> not she's so excited. And it was so cute. Sinkerich actually posed for her in the winter. So I don't know if you guys saw it, but he leaned his head down and kissed you, it looked like, on the top of the head. So how excited are you, and what does this horse mean to you? Oh, that, that was wonderful when he did that with his head. I thought, oh, okay. Uh, this horse, I could not be more prouder of him. He is, he just has such a big heart, and, and every time he will give it all he's got. If he, if he has any kind of pain, he runs through the pain. He, he's just uh, very competitive. Like they said, he likes to be out front. Of course, I love that. That's always good. You got to be an alpha. Got to be in the front, right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> well, congratulations on another win. Thank you so much. This is Rachel live at Indiana Grand. Good luck. Over and Dover, victory third, and Carolina Carl sixth. Top down, 175, 4, 2, 3, 6 on the bottom. Upcoming third race, the Circle City, three-year-old Billy 